Did you feel the earthquake? Officially now, a 4.0 on the Richter scale. Right here, just off the uh, off the shoreline in East Lake, so center just northwest of East Lake. Uh, 4.0. That's pretty. Uh, I mean, it's not it's not going to cause a lot of damage, but for Ohio, it's relatively significant. It's been a while since we've had you know anything like this. Uh, but again, little to no damage. I'm not talking significant as far as damage is concerned. Just significant because of the buzz. This was pretty. Uh, you know, felt pretty far. You know, through downtown Cleveland. I just got off the phone with a lady in Euclid who. Uh, was comparing it to the ones in the late 80s and the one in the 90s and this wasn't quite like that so maybe rattle your uh, windows around if you were in East Lake or around Menor or Euclid, Painesville maybe uh, you know kind of rattle your things on your shelves but as far as damage something like this isn't going to cause damage but I'm sure you felt it I'm sure uh, or if you haven't have felt it then you're hearing about it because our phones have been lighting up ever since and it was that about 1051 was that about the time brian uh yeah i, I had about 1050. 1050? Uh, okay uh 1050 and 44 seconds to be exact oh exact um so yeah 4.0 on the richter scale um and i could not tell you in the last time we've had a, an earthquake uh, of that magnitude um here in ohio if you did feel it want to know a couple things from you your name will pop up on facebook also, we want to know where you are and if you had, if you had any, anything fall over you, what you noticed, how you noticed it, what you heard, kind of what you saw, if you saw anything, uh, and if you remembered the ones from the 80s and the 90s. It if seems, you have any questions about them, let us know. Seems like it's mostly the pets. People's pets, pets are the ones that alerted them to it and are a little freaked out by the, huh. the ground shaking underneath them. Makes sense. So let us know if your pets felt it or heard it also. We heard uh, Shaker Heights, um, someone in Perry, their house shook. Oh, they're Perry. House. <laughs> someone is asking if the salt mine folks are okay. Um, oh, yeah. I don't, we'll have to check on that. Again, this is just now breaking. This is just now just now starting here. So um, we're getting all the information. The phone lines are, are lit up. So we're trying to get as much information as possible. But again, a 4.0 is not going to you know, break buildings down or anything like that probably won't even really break windows, but it may rattle some of the loose ones. And like, like I said, and the only reason I keep saying that if it was on your, you had stuff like on a, on a sill, like a window sill, it might've might shaken some things over. Because when I was in Knoxville, we had one that was, uh, it was about a four point something. And we had a lot of stuff that, that was knocked over, a lot of trinkets and stuff like that. Um, but other than that, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's kind of interesting to, to, see, to, to, to see your report about it.